prepare to be disgusted. First off, Jesuits. Look, oh, look how happy they make it. About us, Jesuits. Okay. The Jesuit Oath. Of course you can't read it. They blur it out, right? But we found it. Many people have spoken on the Jesuit Oath and how disgusting it is, but we're going to go deeper about Pope Gregory, the Gregorian calendar, and the Jesuits, which is called Society of Jesus. But first, pause and read. Extirpate them from the face of the earth, and that I will spare neither age, sex, or condition, and that I will hang, burn, waste, boil, flay, strangle, and bury alive those infamous heretics, rip up the stomach and the wombs of the woman, and crush their infants' heads. Just read the whole thing. This is not a conspiracy. This is the Jesuit Oath. There's another one. Pope Gregory also gave us the Gregorian calendar. This is very deep, but the Bible says that the Antichrist system will change the times to honor itself. It's very deep, but why do you think the Bible says, I hate your feasts and your new moon festivals? They're not ours, they're his, because they're on the wrong days. They Because in earth, as it is in heaven, right? So they change the calendar, So we, but we're back on track now. We're back on track. We know exactly what day of tabernacles we're in right now. But So he gave us a Gregorian calendar after the Julian, first off. Let's see, let's look at his coat of arms. All right, so we got a dragon with a forked tongue. Kind of look like the NASA logo, right? You got the Dagon fish hat. You got the two keys, which I'm imagining are probably the keys of hell and death. The dragon. What does a pope have a dragon? A red dragon. All the jewels and all this gold. Like, come on. And they sent him to the Council of Trent. Council of Trent. The Latin Vulgate. The Latin Vulgate. Any translation of the Bible that you read that has is from the Latin Vulgate, bury it. It changed so many words. It made the day of Christ and the day of the Lord the same word, which it never was. Why would they do that? And what makes them think they have the authority to do this stuff? They'll tell you why. Because it is her uh, majesty's glory, the Pope, that they can do whatever they want. They can make Sunday uh, church day. They just did it. Council of Trent, you know, and getting rid of the uh, forbidden books, they say. Ones that were found in the Dead Sea Scrolls. There's so much to this. You can look into all these orders. Go to his uh, Wikipedia and you can see all this madness. But this is what we're talking about when you say the Vatican has a lot of questions to answer. Not the Catholic people, the Vatican. Look, the Society of Jesus. Society of Jesus. The Jesuits. Read the Jesuit Oath. Look at their little logo. Here's the scum in charge of it now, the superior general. We go straight to Jesus. We go right to the source, not no pope.